Hey everybody, happy Sunday. Welcome to What's for Dinner. Hello. So, um, I lied to everybody yesterday on, um, on the video we did, the What's for Dinner. I told them we weren't going to be doing one today because today was Sunday and it was church. But then I forgot you had some, um, some treats you were fixing today. Yeah. For those folks who don't know, Sundays we typically go to church and then we come home and we have the, uh, the kids here with their significant others. So we make kind of a big dinner. Yeah. So what do we got going on so, here today? We made four KC strips and two fillets for me because I just like fillets. You have the strips are on the bottom there, the KC, uh, sorry, the fillets are on the top, and then um, I always make the fillets a oh, little that's bit more. Be very yeah, more on the rare, rare. side, um, and then the KCs are a little bit a little bit more done. So. Um, and then we have cold bacon. Yeah, I didn't do any extra bacon. Bacon left over. Of course, we have our Jane's crazy seasoning and our uh, Redmond's real salt. That goes on everything just about. Okay, what do we got over here? So then there's eggs, store-bought. Yep. Let me turn these up since it's... And then I made Rosette's dough mix and uh, in a bagel pan. And <clears throat> it's very difficult to see, but I did put string cheese in the center of this. So it is like stuffed crust. So you put it in the center, like around the, um, around the ring of the bagel. Yeah, and then I folded the bagel over top of it. Yeah. It was kind of tricky. Yeah, it doesn't quite... Sometimes it... And well, you then, made a lot this time, so it kind of mushed together, kind of. Yeah, and then you um, pressed garlic into butter, and I melted into melted butter, and I basted that on top. Yeah, you sure did. That looks absolutely delicious right now. And so, you guys, um, those of you who don't know, rosettesmix.com, um, she's got all kinds of low carb, uh, keto friendly products, and uh, the stuff is delicious. And what we love about it, especially, is there's um, it's, it's usually one, two, maybe three ingredients yeah. at the most in um, all of her products. So. Um, definitely. And she has a Father's Day sale going on right now, 15% off, which I'll share on my page uh, in the next day or so. But. but for those of you on YouTube who don't follow the Facebook page that we also have, yeah, it's rosettesmix.com. And, um, you know, you can just order and yep. have it shipped. So. And then I took her sugar cookie mix mm -hmm. and made it and I put it in this pan flat. <clears throat> and then I cooked that until it got, you know, hard. And then I made a keto icing, which is butter cream cheese, confectioner sugar, vanilla, and I just added a splash or two of heavy whipping cream. Mixed it with a hand mixer, mixer and then I put that on top, and then I just obviously cut up blueberry and strawberry, so. Yeah, that looks really good. So right. I've used this as a pie crust before, um, too, for, <laughs> with the peanut butter pie, so. And then this, I don't know if you mentioned, this is the dough mix. That yeah, that's the dough okay, mix. Okay, so you, we make uh, pizza with this. We make um, cinnamon rolls. Cinnamon rolls. We make these uh, these bagels with them. And then you actually in the in the um, in the oven oh. right now, uh, we have a couple of uh, just flat pieces that here I can oh, just yeah. leave the oven open. Just so, a little biscuit piece. Yeah, she makes biscuits out of these. So I asked her to make the leftover uh, dough mix. I knew and... we were forgetting something. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Glad we figured out that was still in there. Um, <laughs> But anyway, we'll put peanut or I'll put peanut butter or, you know, like um, something on that for dessert. Yeah. So and then what do we have going on here, hon? <laughs> Brussels sprouts. Yay. I was like, this looks anemic for a Sunday dinner. So Brussels sprouts um, quartered, sauteed, and two sticks of butter. And then when it's really soft, I put, uh, Mark squeezes fresh pressed garlic in there. And then um, I put heavy whipping cream in there, shredded Parmesan and shredded mozzarella, and then I bake it. Nice. You want to turn it over and show some, show what's in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a so few Brussels good. sprouts yeah. and a lot of butter. Yeah, you wouldn't know that it's actually <laughs> Brussels sprouts you're eating because it's really more like cheese, butter, and uh, and uh, cream cheese, and then a little bit of Brussels sprouts mixed in. It's absolutely delicious. Yeah. Because I'm not a huge Brussels sprout fan, but the way that Teresa makes these with the all the fat and the cream and whatnot in them, it's amazing. Yeah. So. Anyway. Um, yeah, so... Luke we'll, is here. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. Who's Where's this your guy? Yeah. Gone. She's working today. Yeah, I'm working. Gotcha. So we new, only have one girlfriend here. New job. So um, let me ask you guys a question real quick. Okay. Oh. Will any of the stuff we had tonight, metabolically speaking, so remember metabolic health is metabolic health. is the way that uh, insulin and sugar reacts in our body, and, and uh, will any of this cause our blood sugar or insulin to spike? Well, not to my knowledge, it won't. <laughs> Maybe the... Fruit, for chance. The fruit might a little if bit. You, uh, yeah. If you don't have so, too much of it, you'll be all right. Yeah, so if you're like a very, very bad diabetic and your A1C is like 15, you need to skip the fruit. But otherwise, in this family, a little bit, but nothing that's going to make anything worse or create heart disease or diabetes or anything like that. Unless I made 
um, potatoes, rice, pasta, any of that stuff with it. So, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. For sure. Yeah. All right. Well, did you have anything else you wanted to add? No. All right. Well, that was short and sweet today. And uh, so we just wanted to check in and show you guys some little treats that we made because every now and then we have them too. Yes. Every now and, and then. And so we, uh, you guys tell us what you're having for dinner. Yes. Shoot us, shoot us any questions you've got. And then uh, otherwise, we'll see you all tomorrow. We love you and God bless. We hope you have a good week. Yes. Have a good week. Bye. Bye. Peace.